Being in an Apple ecosystem lets you review your iMessages on your iPad running the same Apple account. But sometimes the iPad fails to sync messages from your iPhone. Facing the same issue? Then worry not, as we are going to fix the same problem in this video. Let's begin. If you are using the same Apple ID and still aren't able to sync messages between your iPad and iPhone, then check if you have disabled text forwarding to the iPad. To fix that, open the Settings app on your iPhone and navigate to Messages. Now scroll down to SMS forwarding and tap on it. Enable the toggle next to your iPad. Still facing issues? In that case, you can disable and enable the iMessage service on your iPhone and try again. Doing this resets the sync between devices. To do that, open the Settings app on your iPhone and navigate to Messages. Now disable the iMessage toggle. Wait for a few seconds and then enable it again. One more issue that can be responsible is FaceTime on iPhone. If you leave it disabled on your iPhone, it may interfere with messages syncing on your iPad. To fix that, open the Settings app. Now scroll down and tap on FaceTime. Finally, turn on the toggle next to FaceTime. If you have downloaded dozens of Netflix shows or Spotify playlists, you may soon run out of space on your iPad. It may lead to messages not syncing issues. To fix that, you need to clear some storage space inside your iPad. To do that, open the Settings app on your iPad and tap on General from the left sidebar. Now tap on iPad Storage. Now check for the apps that are taking the most space inside your iPad. Identify the app and tap on it. Finally, tap on Offload App to free up the space. Lastly, if iMessage servers are down, you may face issues syncing the latest conversations on your iPad. Apple offers a dedicated page to check the system status. You can visit the link below and ensure a green indicator beside iMessage. If iMessage is showing an orange or yellow indicator, you must wait for Apple to resolve the issue from their end. Hopefully, you are now able to sync iMessage and normal SMS on your iPhone and iPad. If you like this guide, make sure to follow and subscribe to Guiding Tech for more tutorials related to your everyday technology. And make sure to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.